Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your girl Fanelungu back with another reaction video. If you're new, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. Uh, hope you guys are doing alright. I may stay blessed. Today I'm going to be reacting to Italian Christian regrets to meet Ali Dawa, Ali Dawa, and visitor speakers corner. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. Chicken, I eat beef, I eat lamb. Pork, haram. Ah, uh, you, you cannot eat pork. You can't eat pork. You Christian? Yeah, yeah, I can eat pork. No, Bible is not pork. Jesus never eat pork. Ma, tell me, so th these are the behaviors. Yes. What happen if you misbehave? Do you do you have like a big trouble? Ma, do you have like a priest? Ah. A priest? No. So we we don't go to priest and confess. You know, yeah, you go yeah, priest. Confession. Confession with God. Ah, so you, you confess yes. with God. Yes. Why I go to? How could human being forgive me if I go to a priest? Oh, please forgive me. Okay, yeah, ma, give me money. You, I forgive you. Yeah, ma, if you confess with God, yes. how can you be sure that your confession is good, you know? Okay, so three conditions. Three conditions. Yeah. If I commit sin, so I let's say I drink alcohol. I, I am bad, I do. Number one, I hate. Maybe I should not drink alcohol. Number one, in your heart, you hate the sin. Number two, you stop the sin. Number three, you say, oh God, I don't go back to the sin. Forgive me. However, four conditions. If I punch you, I hurt you, I have to come and ask your forgiveness. You have to forgive me or you punch me back. Uh -huh. Yeah. So if I steal from you money, I have to give the money back. I can't say, oh, God, forgive me, but I owe you 10,000 pounds. I have to pay you money back. So then not only forgiving, God, take my bad deed and make a good deed. Uh -huh. Yeah, man, I mean. So everything is on your in your mind, no? Because you no. have a feedback, like a... no, 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 not feedback. We believe there is evidence why Quran is from our God Almighty. So therefore, in this life, I have good deeds, bad deeds. When I die, I go. God says, how much good deeds? How much bad deeds? Good deeds more? Okay, you go paradise. Good deeds less? Punishment. Ah, okay. So and you have no priest at all. No, we have imams. Somebody who leads prayer, who talk, but not confession, not, oh, I sin, forgive me. No, this is with God. This is why Islam is very important because as Christians, you go to Jesus and God. No, no, we say straight God. Yeah, man. I mean, I prefer to have uh, a feedback, a human being. No, no, but why? But I this, tell you why, yeah, because sometimes it's a grey area, you know, what is bad and good, okay, okay. it's a grey area. Okay. So it's difficult to descend, you know, to say, oh, this is good, this is bad, you know. Okay. I mean, so but I what, if, what if your priest is lying to you? What if you say to him, I killed four people, God forgive me? Yeah, God forgive you, bye-bye. How do you know? Just because he says is good to the ear, but is it the truth? Uh -huh. You don't know. So you, with God, if you're sincere in the heart, the priest, he can't see your heart. But you know your heart. You know I really forget this sin. I very wrong. I ask God to forgive me. Inside you know. But somebody he doesn't care. He killed. They say, please forgive me. Okay, thank you. You got some money. Thank you. I feel better. This is you're lying to yourself. Uh -huh. But internally your heart, God knows. You know. So when you hate the sin, this is a good sign. You repenting. It's a good sign. You hate the sin. But if you love the sin, every day you drink. I forgive. Drink. I forgive. It's also. God can forgive, but internal, your heart is between you and God. Uh -huh. So we say, number one, don't worship, don't say Jesus is God. So Allah says in the Quran, tell the people of the book, you, Christians, Muslim, we come together and we worship God alone. Not Jesus, not Holy Spirit, God. not Muhammad, peace be upon him, not anybody, God. Which one is better? We thank God or we go and thank Jesus or Muhammad, uh -huh. which one better? Hey, no, I mean, uh, yeah. Good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have a child, son? You have? No, no, no. When you get married, you have children? Yeah, yeah. Yeah? No, also another thing, the role of the woman in the Ar Arabic religion, in the Muslim religion. Islam is not Arabic. So I, yeah, I, Islam, look, uh, my friend, he was Christian before. Islam is not Arabic no, religion. In the Muslim only, religion. Only 10 to 15% of Muslims is Arab. The rest is not uh, Arab. This religion is not for Arabs, it's for everybody. Well, Muslim, then the Muslim. Muslim, yes, good, okay. Muslim in Islam, woman's rights. Yeah? Your, your, your girlfriend, yeah? Okay, Islam, you know what Islam says? Can, can she drive? Can, can. Of course she can drive. <laughs> prophet's, prophet's wife 
have camel. You know camel? Yeah, yeah. Because no cars back then. Yeah. It's fine. Saudi Arabia have opinion. We don't. This is not from Islam. Ah. She can drive. No problem. Yeah. But you should drive her. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In Islam, in Islam, when you want to marry her, no girlfriend, boyfriend. Haram. No. Haram. You you speak to her dad. Hello. What's your dad's name, sister? Mateo. Mateo. Hello, Mateo. I love your daughter. I want to marry, please. And she say, okay, what's your name, sister? Uh, Femita. Femita. Say, okay, father, speak to her. Femita, this man wants to marry you. You like him? Yes, father, good man, handsome man. One day you become a Muslim, you know. And you say, I want 10,000 pound. She say, I want 10,000 pound. I have, I'd like to pay. Yes, this is minimum, brother. What do you think this is? Uh, My wife, she give me installment plan. I pay every month. Uh, she very good, yes. Uh, no reba. <laughs> Very expensive. <laughs> she's worth every penny. Ah. Okay, if she's watching this, uh, yes. Anyways, ah. get very nice food, cakes, anything. Anyway, now number one, you speak to the dad. Number two, she asks for gold, watch, car. What she want? Up to you. Up to her. What she want? Number two, you have to do wedding. Wedding. Walima, wedding. You tell everybody, this is my wife. Everybody know. You happy, man? She happy, yeah? yeah? Yeah, yeah. So you have to do wedding. When you marry, you pay for the rent. You know rent? Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you're scared. I can see you're very scared. <laughs> yes. You pay for the rent. You pay for the shopping. You pay for electric, gas, bill. Now Russia problem. Electric prices, gas. <laughs> we finished. Yes. Yes. So she needs some kind of money for shopping. Whatever you can give. Hundred pounds a month. Two hundred pounds a month. This is her right. This is all on your shoulder. The rights of women, this is one thing. So this is your rights, her rights on you. So you have to speak to the dad, ah, wedding, pay, pay, mahar, pay, 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 pay. finish, Rani, we're finished. <laughs> yes, uh, sadly, but this is the right, why? And also, if you walking down the road, somebody come knife. Yeah, yeah. She fight or you fight? Yeah, I fight. Ah, good, you finish now, Yani, Janaza. Yeah, so now you are maintainer and protector. You're like bodyguard, full-time bodyguard. Yeah. But also she, you are the head of the house. In the Christianity it says, uh, Christ is the head of the church and you are the head of something like this. Even in the Bible, she has to listen to you. But not you don't become bad, good. You say, for example, you know, there's one leader in the house, not two. Women, they like a leader, somebody stronger, yeah? So you are the leader of the house. So you make final decisions, yeah? If you tell her, you know, I don't want you to have bad friends, she have to listen to you, yeah? So these things. Woman's rights, for example, she, she doesn't have to take your surname. What's your surname? Uh, novello, novello. Novello. Yeah. I love Italian. Very novello. Ciao bella. Yes. Yeah, yeah. She, your surname, she doesn't have to take. Usually, she have to take your surname, yes? Islam, no. She doesn't take your surname. Yeah, but one moment, but yes. this thing in Islam, so is it still working? You know? Yes. Because you know that now the world is changing, the role of yes. the woman is changing. Yes, yes. Sorry. No, what? Sorry, sorry. I don't speak Arabic. Once again. Yeah. But yeah. So is it working? It, look, let me tell you why it would work. In today's time, the roles of genders have been you know, yeah, mix. mix. Why? Because now feminism come. Feminism come and say to the woman, yeah, you go work. Yeah, I know we have to smash feminism. Me, I smash feminism every yeah, so day. So how, how, how they uh, Muslim cope with feminism? We smash intellectually. Now, <laughs> why? Okay. Because feminism say to a woman, you are just like a man. No, she is psychologically, mentally, physically, emotionally. Yeah. She is different. She yeah. needs, she needs protecting. She needs loving. Yes. So. Feminism say no, you go work till you're 30, 30 years old, woman less likely to conceive, have a baby, become hard. So Islam says no, women have a role, man have a role. They are not the same, they are different. There's something she needs, you have to give something you need. So Islam deals with reality. Feminism is a dream, you know dream? You yeah. sleep, you wake up, oh. Feminism is a dream. So Islam give a solution to whole mankind. Number one, with God, relationship with God, to relationship with us, relationship with your wife and your society. Islam wants this because women have certain rights. But today's society, they make a woman, they think the sexual liber liberation, they think this gives rights to women. No, because men are happy. 
Now they have what they want, no marriage. Have sex, have this, have that, and no marriage. This is yeah, yeah. not good for a woman. For a woman, it is better that she has certain things. You like me? You want to marry me? Okay. Speak to my dad, Maher, wedding. Iman, he ran away. He said, no, I don't want this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why Islam has these things to protect women. Otherwise, now men are lucky. Go sleep around. They don't want it. You know men don't get married anymore. Why you get married? You get everything you get in a marriage. Why is it going to get? Why would I pay ten thousand pounds? Do a wedding? I get what? Uh, yeah, I understand. I understand. Do you understand? Oh, last question. Is it compulsory mm. to attend a church, a mosque? Uh, once a week. Compulsory. Friday, compulsory. Once a week, compulsory. Because But we compulsory five times we pray. Okay. Because in it, uh, in Christian world, we have the same thing. Once a week, compulsory. Sunday. But yes. But. Uh, nowadays, this thing is going down and down. I mean, the exactly. population that yes. really attends yes. the church is getting older and older. And, and a lot of atheists in Italy, I heard. Exactly. Yes. So, my question is, is the Muslim religion suffering the same problem of having only okay. old people attending yeah. the praise mm. and not the, the, the young ones? Let me tell you something. One day, you live in London? Yeah, yeah. Okay. There's a mosque. One day, Friday, I want you to go and watch. The mosque, the one in, uh, in Regent's Park, Park. You know the big one? Yeah, yeah, very big Friday, one. Friday, 1 p.m., go and watch. See how many elderly, how many young people. Uh, Everybody go. You know why? Why? Because when atheism came to the Western world, millions of Christians, they leave their religion. Yeah, why? Yeah. Islam didn't suffer this much. Yes, some people, they leave Islam, some. But in reality, in totality, a lot of people come to Islam. In every five people come to Islam, three are women. Why? Because women understand the liberation, this liberalism that has been given to them, it's nothing but heartache. They don't want to work. Woman's nature, she wants to have a child, she wants to be at home, she wants to cook, clean. Not everyone, they can work if they want, but innately, this is what she wants. So society today has corrupted that. That's why you look at Muslims, yeah. young people, they pray. A lot of young Muslims, they pray. But yeah, Christianity, because of Trinity, Trinity doesn't make sense. The Father, the Son, Holy Spirit. Which one is God? So Holy Spirit, the Son, the Father. So we say, the, what you call the Father, we say the true God is Allah, the one who yeah, created yeah, us. Yeah, yeah. yeah, well, I understood. I mean, uh, yeah. because the, the Italian religion, the Christian religion is yeah. suffering many problems. But also because of its belief system. If the belief system is yeah, yeah. foundations of we, in Islam, we know there are foundations. Oh, can, you, can you give me? Yes, this is free for you. You are one sister. No, no, I, th I think... Uh, You're sharing, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Islam. no problem. It's in English. Yeah, yeah, it's English. <laughs> Ma, uh, well, last question. So no problem, you, ask you as read, many. You read, uh, I mean, you read the Quran and yes. you, you learn. No? Yes. Nothing else. No, no you Just learn read. in English and also pray. I mean, now the question is, is everything written here? Everything you need to know is in here. Ah, okay. In the Quran, everything you need to know is here. Ah, okay, okay. Yes. Read it, pray to God. Say, God, if this is true, guide me. Yeah. You pray? Well, uh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to church now. Huh? Yeah? To, to... Pray to God, not Jesus, not yeah, Holy Spirit. Of, co of course. To God. The, the point that I'm a little bit disappointed is because is the difficulty how the Christian religion is uh, uh, coping with this new world. You exactly. Know? That's the difficult part. But that's the know? problem. Islam has a way of life. Yeah. It's same 1400 years ago, same now. Same system. Because it's the best system. And now people are realizing women are less happy. So yeah. what's happening, people going back to traditional values. So they're turning back. Christianity, now they put their guards down, whatever. No problem, you want to do this? This is, not, this is why people leave Christianity. Islam says no, we have rules and regulations. We don't change. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, thank you very much for your... Novelli. Novelli. Yeah, exactly, yeah, exactly. My name is Ali. Ali, yeah, you too. Nice yeah. meeting, yes. Yeah. Look after yourself. The... You make sure you speak to the father, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get married, I call your father, double yeah, check, yeah. yeah? Oh, thank you. You call me to the wedding, yeah? yeah? Okay, take care. Assalamu alaikum. Yeah, that's it. Uh, 
uh, this was a fun and very interesting video uh, the guy really had some good questions which we people should be asking ourselves you know it's okay to ask questions asking questions doesn't mean you believe you disbelieve whatever it is that you are better believing or whatever it is that you're hearing you know always be open to knowledge and knowledge will come to you although i was wondering when you came about feminism how exactly does the quran make sure that women are provided for you know that women are taken care of or that the rights are not infringed upon and um for example if there's a couple and the woman wants to work does the quran say anything towards us that does the husband have to agree to the woman to work I mean, there are just some people that say, you know what, I feel like I should work just for the sake of working because they love to work. What happens in such a situation, you know? Uh, let me know what you guys think about this video. It was very, very entertaining and I really loved the answers Ali was giving. Let me know what you guys think. Please motivate me by giving me stuff to react to. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Share it with your friends. And of course, do not forget to subscribe and I'll see you in my next reaction video.